Space Coast. Welcome to the News in 90 Seconds for Friday, October 21st. I'm Rob Landers bringing you some of today's top local stories. The weather isn't the only thing that's cooled off in Brevard lately. The real estate market is feeling the effects of the Federal Reserve's moves to increase interest rates, according to the Florida Realtors Industry Data and Analysis Team. Brevard's closed home sales were down 13% in September compared to the same month a year prior. Cash sales also dropped by just more than 16%. New pending sales were down too, a 30% drop from September to September, and new listings were also down for the month by almost 15%. But there may be a bigger issue at play on the Space Coast. Check out what's happening in the Brevard real estate market in our subscriber-exclusive story on floridatoday.com. Nearly a million square feet of industrial space is in the works for Titusville with the hopes of bringing manufacturing and much-needed support for the commercial aerospace needs in the area. Key Holdings Group LLC has filed plans to develop 50 acres on Grissom Parkway and Perimeter Road near the Space Coast Regional Airport in Titusville, where the future Space Coast Innovation Park is in the initial planning stages. Get more details on the development in Tyler Vasquez's story on floridatoday.com. Brevard County voters will have a lengthy ballot to consider for the November 8th election, including statewide, county, and municipal candidate elections and referendum items. Be sure to check out our complete election voter guide available now at floridatoday.com. Not yet a subscriber? Unlock unlimited digital access to your best source for news and information on the Space Coast. Visit floridatoday.com slash subscribe. And that's 90 seconds. Thanks for watching.